whether you be Z scale, N scale, HO scale, or O scale. We have a new and improved rescaled diner that's gonna fit perfect on your layout. Welcome to the Iron Horse Route, home of the Denver and Rio Grande Western. This is Brian. I'm glad you're here. And if you're not already a subscriber, I want to encourage you to subscribe because when you're a subscriber here, you get access to a lot of great model railroad video uploads. And so now that you're subscribed, we invite you to sit back, relax, and enjoy today's video upload, which is coming up right now. So what we did is a couple weeks ago, we rescaled this Z-Scale version for a customer and we decided to go ahead and redo all of them. So then we went live and we did the HO version. Then we went live this past Friday on Foamer Friday and we did the O-Scale version. That's finished up now. I'm gonna show you more about that later. And then what we're gonna do today in this video, since we've already got an instructional video that's gonna show you how to put this model together properly, I'm gonna put a card right here right now for that. But what we're going to do in here is we're just going to do a quick time-lapse video showing me assembling the N-Scale version, and then we're going to get to the good part of the video. We're going to be showing the models, all four of them together, so you can get appreciation for the size difference in scale. And then we're going to also have detailed measurements on each one of them as we do 360 looks at them. So you know exactly how big the footprints of each of these models are because we do have it in Z scale, we have it in N scale, we have it in HO scale, and we have it in O scale, everybody. We're glad to have O scale now because the guys in O scale seem to be that they can't get a whole lot of good kits because I get a lot of uh, requests from them and there's only a limited amount of things I can do, but I could do this diner for you guys. So I do have the O scale diner now. I'm proud to announce that. We hope you'll stick around right now. Real quick, we're gonna do a fast time lapse with me doing the end scale assembly and then we're going to slow things way down and we're going to come back to where we actually show the 360 degree versions of all the models and show exact measurements and these kind of things and we're looking very forward to showing you these things so let's get to it right now. 